Lord Holmes of Richmond, Chris, delighted to be at Ashram 2018, fabulous conference, really loved the energy, the presentations, the themes that have come through, what could be better than spending time with people, discussing the big ideas of our time, making yourself think and coming away with new ideas and coming away definitely wanting to spend more time in this region. What I covered in my presentation was the possibility from the fourth industrial revolution for IR, not least artificial intelligence. And I think the key point is for people to understand the everythingness of 4IR. It has the potential to change everything that we do, both professionally, in our social, our leisure lives, but also that alongside the everythingness, everything and nothing changes. So the technology, machine learning, internet of things, robotics, huge change in our possibilities of what we can achieve, but the nothingness, the human, the human heart, how we live, how we love, that remains the same. All the answers that we need to make an absolutely roaring success of 4IR, we have in our heads, in our hearts, and in our history. What really excites me about 4IR is, for the first time, talent will eclipse capital as the most significant factor of production. Talent, that's you and I, that's everybody. It's not just talent in terms of people who are high-end data analytics experts, it's people who understand organisational design, target operating models, change management, all of those things and more. Talent will eclipse capital. And what makes that particularly exciting in this region is that if you look at the equation that you can do, the financial capital is here. When you add that to the human capital, that hyper-augmented human capital through 4IR, AI, machine learning, and so on, hyper-augmented human capital, digital education, digital literacy put in there to the human capital. Look at the youth of the region. Financial capital plus that human capital has got to equal fantastic, fabulous future capital. Data is absolutely critical to all and every element of 4IR. Everything is predicated on the data. Data is described as a new oil. It's far more profound than that because it's an infinite resource. But we all have to be thoughtful as individuals and as organisations about that data. As an organisation, if you want to do some really interesting things with machine learning, well, you first got to consider what data do you have? Have you collected the data you want? What form is it in? Is it analysable? What do you want to do with that data? That's the everythingness. But again, the nothingness changed. The thing that remains the same is garbage in, garbage out. Machine learning can't make bad, untidy, unclean, messy data, good data. Everything and nothing changes. But data is absolutely at the heart. It underpins, it's the energy, it is the fuel for this fourth industrial revolution, which is a fantastic thing because it's infinite but we all need to be really thoughtful about all of the elements of how that data is used and to start from that critical understanding, it's our data. It's been a delight to be at Ashram 2018. The energy, the sense of purpose, the sense of focus in the room and the conversations in the breakout sessions, a real positive environment to be in and I think that underpins the excitement that I have for this region. The demography, such potential when you have such a large youth population. What can be done? Almost anything can be done. The potential is almost limitless. I think that's really come through from the speakers on the stage, from the panel sessions, even more so from the conversations that have broken out in the room, often between people who may have never met each other before coming to this conference, have really sensed that, a fundamentally positive, life-affirming, really fabulous thing to be a part of.